Today we're going to create this text on road effect with some simple tricks in Snapseed app. Before starting, a big shout out to my channel members for the support. On this image, I will try to create a text on the bottom part of the road. I will be adding the text my path here. First, I'm going to turn the image to black by going to curves and dragging the top point to the bottom. I'm going to create the text my path in two lines. So going to the text tool, changing the style to the second option here and typing path which will be in the second line. Changing the text color to white. Making it as small as possible and dragging it to the bottom. You will know later why I am doing this. Similarly adding my word now. Just placing it on top of the word path as close as possible to it. Can't make it any smaller. So going back and making the word path a little bigger. Now going to the perspective tool and choosing the tilt option and selecting black in the fill option. Now dragging it up. Repeating it again. Again with perspective tool, choosing the scale option now. Dragging it up to make it scale down vertically. Saving this. Going back to the original image. Adding the save text with double exposure. Placing and scaling it down. I'll choose the overlay option which gives some interesting transparency to get the parts underneath look better. Decreasing the opacity. This has darkened the image a bit. So compensating by brightening the overall image with curves. Adding a selective filter on the text to make it pop a little. Another example here, repeating the same steps. Here adding the text road to heaven in different lines with yellow color. As you can see, can't decrease the text anymore. If I do the perspective tilt option, the text is cropped. So I will use expand tool to increase the canvas on either sides a few times.
then coming back to the perspective tool with tilt option to get the intended look. Also using the scale option. Saving it and adding it through double exposure with overlay mode. Couple more edits to get the text pop more. One more example. Adding text here with a color close to the shirt. Choosing bright red here. Going back and adding black layer. Next, the steps with the perspective tool. Saving and adding it through double exposure, placing it a bit down with overlay mode, reducing the opacity. First compensating some brightness and adding pop to the text. Then going back to the masking screen in double exposure and removing the text on the subject to get this interesting effect. Hope you all found the tricks here useful and subscribe for more. Thanks for watching.